about six years ago, um, I had just graduated college and I was at a gathering and I had some older married friends with a couple of kids and I remember looking at them as my friend grabbed his screaming four-year-old from his chair because he didn't want to go home or he lost his favorite dinosaur or something, I don't remember what it was. And I remember thinking, wow, that looks exhausting, I never want that. And I remember talking to him a couple weeks later and, you know, talking to him about it. I'm like, you know, what, what's it like? You know, like, what? it looked so exhausting. How could that possibly be fun? And he said it was this, he was his, that his son was the single greatest joy in his life. And I think I remember saying something to the effect of, wow, I don't think you've got enough sleep because I don't think you believe what you just said. Um, and then later I got married and I had Ella. Well, sorry, my wife had Ella. I did not have Ella. Um, about two, a little over two years ago, and it has been the craziest, messiest, loudest, I, and every single other adjective, but it has been also the most beautiful and the most joyful and the most, just the happiest I think I can remember myself ever being. Because children have this way of bringing a light that you had no idea was missing into your life. Um, just the other day, Ella smashed a popcorn container, and we had popcorn kernels everywhere and glasses everywhere, and I'm thinking, someday she's just going to fall off a cliff or something, and I'm not going to be watching or whatever. But and I was in that moment, I was angry because I got to clean up glass, I got to clean up popcorn, and then an hour later, I had forgotten about it because she was giggling or playing in her room, and all I heard was her talking to herself, and I just remember thinking, wow, what a blessing this child is in my life. It has been one of the greatest challenges, but also the single greatest blessings, and I think of my friend often, every time I think about how tired I am or how I'm so grateful for uh, my child because that was the precursor to what I would be experiencing about six years later. And, I, and I, I call him every now and again and I tell him, you know, you were right. And he goes, what? And I was like, you were right. <clears throat> I don't sleep. I have popcorn in my hair. I have gum in my shoe. I don't know where in the world any of this came from, but darn it if I am not the happiest I've ever been in my life. And my friend loves to tell me, told you so. So he ended that phone call with, told you so. I think one of the greatest things about being a parent is you don't realize how great it is until you are one. And um, it simply is just one of the greatest joys you can ever experience.